welcome to your reading for Tuesday the 14th of August. My name's Sonia. Um, firstly, a warm welcome to my channel. If you're listening for the first time, then I do also have um, monthly zodiac readings as well. Um, for the daily readings, I'm using two decks of cards. The Dark Goddess Oracle Cards by Barbara Michael John Free and Flavia Kate Peters. These are beautiful cards. And also the tarot deck, the Celtic Tarot by Christopher Hughes. Again, the energy on the cards is beautiful. Okay, I have pulled a card for the overall energy for you. And the card that I've pulled is Sovereignty. Okay. So what does that mean for you? Well, I feel that you need to be defensive. There's going to be a lot of um, need to be to pull back. It's almost as though you've been through a lot lately and you've suffered a lot. And you've built up your defences for protection. It's almost as though you're ready for action if needs be. This card, when it shows up like this, is about you choosing your fights carefully. But don't be afraid of any drama. Let others know that you mean business, that you won't be walked over. You can always do this in a loving and a kind way. This is about being true to you, being protective, being defensive, not to be ruled by others. It's about not avoiding conflict, but actually facing it head on. It's about building up your strength as well. It's a lovely card. Okay, so let's see whether the tarot can shed light on that situation. Is there any more guidance that can come? On the tarot. Okay, and the first card that we have is the Two of Wands. Now, the Two of Wands is about our passion, our inner drive, our creativity. This is our soul purpose. This is this is the card that, that gives us the energy to actually put things into plant those seeds, plant those foundations, make things happen. And it all begins with a thought. It's our thoughts that actually make things happen. Now with the twos, there's always a choice or a decision. So this is about where you're gonna put your energy. And we're talking here about conflicts and struggles. Are you gonna give that your energy? Or are you gonna focus on energy on something else? How much of your energy are you gonna to give to that situation? Because you always, always have a choice. Okay, so let's see what you need to do about it. And we have the High Priestess, which is number two. Again, the twos have come out a lot in the daily readings this week. Obviously, there's lots of decisions to be made. The High Priestess is the Keeper of Secrets, so maybe there is things that you don't need to tell somebody else. Maybe there's things that somebody isn't telling you. This is where you need to use your own inner knowing, your own inner knowledge. The High Priestess is naturally clairvoyant. She's naturally psychic. So use those powers within you to know and trust what the universe is telling you. Okay, so let's see what the final outcome will be. And 
and the final outcome is father figure which is the emperor in many other decks father figure is about stability <coughs> security that strength that you have here in the sovereignty card that strength and power this is what you get from the father figure as well. Solid, firm foundations. Some beautiful cards here. Beautiful cards. So the key messages for Tuesday is if someone's picking for a fight, don't walk away from it, face it head on. Find out all the facts, make your choices and deal with it in a loving and kind way, but don't get caught up in the drama. Put your passion into what it is that you want to manifest. Use your own instincts, your true inner knowing to make it happen because the security, the strength and the solid foundations being in total control is there for you. Okay, well, I hope you all have a beautiful day. If you would like a private reading with me, then please contact me via my email, <coughs> sonia at the tarot .com, or you can contact me via either of my websites, spiritualcenter.net and the tarot .com. The links are in the description, as well as links to the cards and that that I use in my readings. Okay, well, I hope you all have a beautiful day. Thank you for listening.